Hello there, YouTube. This is the end of Thanksgiving. Everybody's bailing out. Abby. <laughs> it is seriously cold out here. Abby says, I'll go with you. See ya. Bye bye. Love you. Bye. Oh, you've got face recognition. Yeah. <laughs> Need a oh, flip it up. Maybe you'll look at that. that. You look cute in that coat. You look adorable. Who is that? Who is that on the screen? He gets so excited in the mirror. Look at me. Look at he's smiling. He goes, I see myself. <laughs> Flip the screen up, honey. <laughs> yeah, I showed him that this morning or last night. The camera. I turned the camera facing him because uh -huh. he's playing with my phone. He's like, <laughs> he goes, hey, I can see my towel. <laughs> he used to cry when I showed him himself in the mirror. Yeah, I don't know. It's like, like that. Yeah. <laughs> so, Mama? This looks a whole lot emptier than it did just a little bit ago. Yeah, it does. It's just the aftermath. Yep. It's just you and I and the and the animals again. Yep. They've all come, conquered all the food, and bailed out on us. Yep. Now you want it all. Come it all happens too. All it all happens too quick, doesn't it? It does. Come so now we know what our what our parents felt like when. Oh, it's yeah. not fair. I had all the dishes done before they got here. Now it's aftermath and of the chaos. The refrigerator is still absolutely slam full of of stuff. That's yep. what's left of it. We, that turkey, I don't think I've seen one <laughs> strip down to the bone like that quite so quick. Yeah, he, yeah, they liked it. Yeah. That turned out good. I mean, it just fell off. I was so tickled. I have... And then I didn't film anything. I, I, was, I was so upset over losing that video and I'm cold and it just never, the vlog just never came to me. Gotcha. Yeah. You know, I just never, I never got to the point where everybody's here. Because all the kids, uh, my oldest daughter, they're up in Tacoma and they, they did Thanksgiving up there. But uh, our other three kids, uh, Christy, Kyle, and Ryan, um came here with their significant others and uh, had to go to their other families for Thanksgiving as well so they got out of here what is it got heck it's only yeah, it's, they left they were all gone by five o'clock but um yeah Ryan and then had to leave at four yeah so know. Ryan and his girlfriend left early and they were already here when I got here and they ate and hung out a little bit and then they had to go so the vlog, vlog didn't happen, and everybody's talking about everything. They were watching football games, and it was all scattered. Just the, I just never got to a point I felt it was right to pull the camera out and vlog. So uh, we'll have to do some other thing, and and I wanted to tell scary story or scare stories or prank stories that we did with the kids with the kids yeah, here. You know, hear their side of the story too. Now that they're much older, um, their ver their version of the story is probably pretty interesting. You know, you uh, you don't you miss like details. Like you remember certain details, they remember different details, and it's cool to get the two get all the stories going together, and you get the full full thing of it. I thought that'd be interesting, but we never we never uh, calm <laughs> we never calm down enough to uh, to let that happen. Uh, we're just staring at your back all the time. I'm sorry. The light oh, went out over the stove where I could oh, light her face up. I thought you were talking to the camera. It's an old so stove. Over here doing. Yeah. Doing. Or vent. It's not part of the stove. Anyway, got a real, real lackluster vlog for the day. Well, sometimes but that's the way it, it way it goes. Yeah. It just happens that way. Got dogs all at my feet waiting for something that might accidentally something fall off of off fall. of a plate somewhere. We're terrible. The plates, like the pan she's cleaning up, she's just gonna throw it on the ground yeah, and let them go yeah. at it. When you guys aren't looking, it's going on the floor yeah. for the dogs, so. Yeah, we're not gonna show you feeding the dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Is 
but anyway, we had a nice little festive evening. It seemed seemed all kind of rushed, which they they do sometimes. Now we now we know what like Kelly and I were saying. Now we know what what our parents felt like because. Yeah, you're you know, being kids. To get it all ready and just so and yeah. all decorated, and, and it's like hurry up, eat, and gone. Yeah. You know, but I understand that. You and I've been there. Yeah, when we were kids, you know, yeah, you know it is. You you're you're young and you got plans, parties, whatever, whatever the hell it is you got going on, and uh, yeah, there's only so much of your your parents you want to hang around with you know, yeah, I know. It's like, You're not my and now we're kind of that way thing. now we're the old, now we're the old fogies and the kids are looking for the out i'm literally chasing you around there right? i am right here <laughs> but anyway right. i didn't think you want to uh, stop yeah. i was just making an observation uh, uh, that yeah. you're like running circles around me no i don't mean to i was just trying but. to put the stuff away before dogs find it oh yeah dogs jump up and grab whatever off the counter oh yeah They'll do that. Hmm. No, not at all. <laughs> As they're all sitting here going. Mm -hmm. So it is only ten after quarter after five almost now. So uh <laughs> so we'll uh I'm not gonna end the end it yet. Maybe we'll just yeah, we'll, we'll sit down else, sit like down that. at the table in there and tell some crazy story or something. Maybe we can do that. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Book them up something. Night's not over. <laughs> we're back so trying not to lose the whole day we thought we'd sit down and tell you one more uh well i guess it wasn't a prank it is actually it was accidental but it it worked out to, yeah it turned into one yeah so last night yesterday's vlog you heard us heard me refer to uh you know the bathroom of the blair witch so we were in texas and uh oddly enough this involves kyle again <laughs> <laughs> Poor, thing. Poor guy he is here tonight he was the white car that was him and his and uh diana's girlfriend uh leaving when i walked out there if i if i use that footage i don't know but um anyway uh this was probably around 90 99 98 99 yeah uh, where we're living in texas across the street well, not directly across, but we call it across the street. It was probably the equivalent of a couple blocks. Yeah, it's just behind the elementary across the street from our house. Yeah, the elementary is a couple blocks over across the street. And uh, they had a nice playground. We used to ride our bicycles over there all the time, take the kids. And, you know, we'd get them across the... It was just a... I mean, it was a highway, but it wasn't overly traveled. But uh, anyway, we got across there. And, and uh, one day we went over and... It was, uh, I think it was Ashley, was it Christy, Ashley, and Ryan, I think, had their bicycles. And um, Kyle, I think, he had his bicycle, but Kelly yeah. was, was hovering around. You were with uh, Christy and Ashley. So it was just us three boys, wasn't it? Yeah. I could have sworn one of the girls was with me. No, I think, I think Ryan stayed with me. And Christy and oh. Ashley and Kyle okay. were with you. Ryan, so it was the who three... was the youngest, stayed with me. That's right. Played on the playground. So it was the three, the three oldest. But uh, Ashley's the oldest. Then it's Christy. Then it's Kyle. Then it's Ryan. So we're out on our bicycles, and and Kelly was staying around where the little playground areas. Oh, I left out one important detail. It's pitch black dark. Oh yeah, but you they know. have like lights there at the playground. You know, the playground's lit up, but is now getting dusk in the woods. Yeah, it was pitch black dark in them woods. Yeah, it was dark <laughs> in them woods. But anyway, I used to ride my bicycle back and forth to work all the time. It's a, a mongoose. This is before mongoose went out of business and Walmart's whoever bought out the name. You know, they're a cheap bicycle now, but I um, mean, you guys that know the history of bicycles, you know, in the 90s, mongoose was a big player along with you know specialized and giant and those guys and uh anyway i've got one of their um you know pro grade or whatever bicycles it was really expensive i remember that but anyway i had a nice light on it because i um i worked late at night um and i have to drive home at night and you in texas you had to have lights on plus you need to see where you're going anyway 
So we go across the field, we're just goofing across, goofing around, and there was a section of woods that went from this uh, grade school over to uh, Texas High, the big high school there in, in Texarkana. And uh, we go up to them woods, you know, it's like kind of one of these little dairy things, you know, a, a dare with the kids, you know, to see if they would drive through them woods. So we get to the edge of the woods, and uh, here... It just recently come out on TV, and the kids, you know how you try to keep your kids from watching scary yeah, shows? Yeah, not supposed to watch this. Yeah, well, somehow, another, some way, somehow, they all watched the Blair Witch Project on HBO or whatever it was on. Bad thing for a kid. It was yeah. a bad thing for an adult. Scared the holy, holy yeah, crap out of me. I woke, I woke, woke up in the up. middle of the night and that thing was on i thought i was watching something i had no idea you know you wake up in the night the tv's on i'm watching this thing oh my golly oh my god you ought to see i was freaking out you know like most people i thought it was real right at first but anyway the kids come across it and the one person that was the most freaked out about it was kyle all you had to say was blair witch and he oh. would freak out yeah so we're at the edge of the woods and I'm pointing my headlight and behind us is the big field, you know, and you look around and you can see the, see the backside of the school and the big lit up area where the playground was, where Kelly was. And this is several hundred yards away. It's a huge, you know, bigger than a football field, this big field area behind the school. And, um, man, we're sitting at the edge of the woods and we start, everybody wants to go, you know, so we start rolling in. And I go, oh my God, there's the Blair Witch. And I knew it was going to freak Kyle out, you know. So, I mean, it's literally, it couldn't have been five seconds. I turn around to see what Kyle's reaction. I thought, that might be pushing it too far, you know. Yeah, I'm, I'm going a, into the woods and, yeah. Yeah. I turn around. And <laughs> look, and there, there's no Kyle. He is gone. And I'm, I'm like looking all around going, what the hell? So I look back way, way back over towards where Kelly's at thinking, you know, surely he must have headed that way, you know, but that's a long ways away. I turn around and they're like a cartoon thing. There is a dust trail going across that field and over to where Kelly was. And he was almost right at her, literally oh. within seconds. This kid... He was flying so fast, he was sucking the dust off the ground. Oh, yeah. He had to have been, I mean, literally just floating. I, there's no way so that afraid. kid ran that fast. And now I see in that dust trail, <laughs> and all I could see is the back of him. Just, it's like his head was back, and he's just <laughs> running for all his worth. Running for everything he had. Oh, my God. I never laughed so hard in my entire la life in the... I think it was the two girls. It was yeah. Just hysterical. I, I think Ashley literally, literally wet I, herself. I think she did. Yeah. That was the funniest thing ever. I mean, he just literally vaporized. Whoop, went across that field. Said, oh, oh. My ass is gone. And yeah. it wasn't so funny when I got... We didn't go through the woods. We turned around and went back. And uh, we get there and Kyle's like cling to to kelly and kelly was not very happy with me <laughs> no 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 you know he doesn't like that that's so cruel You're right at the edge of the woods and we had just kind of entered into the woods yeah you can't scare my babies oh man oh but it is humanly not possible for him to have Dumb made it that moved. distance yeah but seeing that dust trail i mean literally like a cartoon thing you know where the little character like, runs across like and leaves a dust trail, you know? Yeah. He left a dust trail behind him. He was going so fast across that field. But, oh, man, that was funny. God, we laughed about that for... God, we've told that story for years. Oh, I know it. Someone under the excitement of telling the story didn't seem so <laughs> exciting. But sometimes sometimes yeah. they play off, sometimes they don't. But that was really, really funny. It wasn't funny right at the moment, but it became yeah. really funny. Yeah, it is definitely a family like joke. Yeah. To like, scare you know, just say Blair Witch and Kyle will remember vividly. Oh yeah. Being scared in the woods and hauling you know what. One of those to old, get out. One of those old family tales that'll get passed on from And you'll probably never forgive us for it. Well you. I oh, was I was uh, the savior. 
because I wasn't part of it. <laughs> I'm sure you Not know. on this one. <laughs> I think he even laughs about it now. Oh, he yeah. remembers it though. He oh, clearly yeah. remembers it. And uh, this was probably around the same time of the bathtub oh, scare yeah. too. Oh yeah, yeah. That, that thing with that mask. I didn't even know they had that mask. I don't know. I think it was Ashley or some, who, I or one of her friends, come up with somebody it. Somebody had it. I yeah. remember Kelly jumping out with that thing on when I came home, because I'd come home and I'd come to the front door, and uh, you know, of course, I got my own keys. I'd come in and I'd push the bicycle in, because it's summer. Even at Halloween, it's it's hot. Yeah. And uh, oh man, it felt so good to get off that bicycle and step into that air conditioned house. Ooh. But I uh, come walking in there and Kelly comes out with that mask and I literally about peed pee myself. Like I said, I'm sure I scream like hell. Oh yeah, he's really funny to scare. He is hysterical. People have love scaring the hell out of me. They get me at work all the time. I'll be deep into something, concentrating, looking at a manual, trying to find a flat rate or an answer to somebody's question or whatever. And, and I don't know how they sneak right up on me, but next thing I know, they're standing right there. And, ah! So they'll come. do the same thing when we're at the house. I mean, I'm making enough noise to wake the dead out here. You know, blah, 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 running around, doing whatever, go in there. Sean, whoosh, you come out of the chair. You're just like so much. And I got this one really weird thing, and I don't know why. I mean, literally scares me more than anything, is if you come walking in with some animal. Oh yeah. She'll come in oh, here and walk up to my geez. desk and have a chicken in her hand. And she's just asking me, is there something wrong with this chicken or whatever? And literally, I, I do the I pile holding... up the wall in the bathroom thing. <laughs> you would swear I was holding the devil itself. Oh, I don't know my why God. that. She goes, that's just a chicken. And the chickens go, rah, rah, you know. Yeah, because now you scared it. Dogs will have puppies and when they get old enough, she'll finally get and she'll pick one up and she'll come in. Oh, look at this cute little thing. Bah! <laughs> <laughs> I'll oh. never forget this girl her name was Courtney and this is at the the party factory it was a huge liquor store I've told you guys all about that I worked at it was a friend owned it his family owned it and uh, we had a <laughs> it was a drive through liquor store and uh, this is up in Texas actually it's on the Arkansas side Texacana, Arkansas you know Texacana twice as nice you know half of yeah. it's in Texas half of it's in Arkansas Texas side is dry county, the Arkansas side is wet. But uh, the drive through you can have the drive through open until midnight. Yeah. And at like 9 o'clock you had to stop selling hard liquor. You could sell uh, wine coolers and beer after after that. But anyway, it was during normal hours, you know, prior to 9. I was in the office, I don't know if I was, I was doing some kind of book work or counting a drawer or something. And uh, somebody drove up in the, in the drive through with a boa constrictor. And she comes walking in, and I, and I'm busy doing whatever. She goes, Sean, check this out. And I, you know, okay. And I finally I turn and I look, and all I see is a snake in my face. You should have heard some scream in there. Oh my God, I had all them cashiers literally losing it. Oh, they yeah. they laughed. I think they laughed for weeks over that. <laughs> I mean, the look on my face must have been worth a million bucks. It had to be literally the look of staring the Grim Reaper right in his... Oh, yeah. Right in his eyeballs. Well, he doesn't have eyeballs, does he? He's kind of dark, and he's doing this thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know why. Uh, Those things, she always freaks out. It's a kitten! Yeah, it's just a lot of crap. Well, they come walking up, you're sitting in a desk, and they go, here, look, and the eyes of an animal's in your face, and you're just, ah! <laughs> <laughs> I've always, uh, when I was a kid, I always have shit jumping out at me, you know, snakes and all kinds of stuff, you know, so you're always, you're always afraid. I don't know how many times I've had dogs come at me and stuff. I will fight a dog, probably, and I'm so slow and old now, but... When I was a kid, I'd take a dog out. You know, and the dog was ever going to get a bite on me. <laughs> I'd literally, I've had big dogs on the ground choking it, trying to kill the son of a bitch. And I'm mad at the dog because he scared me so bad, you know. But uh, I don't know how. Ain't no dog going to get me, though. No. Nope. They, they'd eat me alive now, though. I'd go, <laughs> let me try to run. <laughs> <laughs> One thing is, don't run. Yeah, when never you run, it's like. Stand your ground. Yeah. Uh, Game on, that dog says, 
target. Yeah, you're no prey. You ain't gonna outrun that dog. No, you cannot outrun any dog. Even a little, you can't outrun Sophie if uh -uh. she was in her prime. Yeah, well, that the way she is now, she can move. haul butt. Yeah. She's always had this thing where she, bloop, she stands up on her and just kind of <laughs> props up on her little butt. <laughs> it looks like somebody's standing up a, a hot dog. You know? I know, I just, yeah. Boom. She's like, oh, what the hell, look at that. She just kind of goes, oh, she just, <laughs> just teeters on her two legs and her little butt. Yeah, her you know? tiny legs. I mean, they're the size of a couple yeah. of little pretzels. But she was doing that tonight, begging, of course, begging for food. All this food's around, they're cleaning dishes, and kids are walking around nibbling on stuff, and she's going, <laughs> <laughs> Please, somebody drop something. Yeah, so she's healthy enough that she's running and uh, standing up. Yeah. Propping up. <laughs> That's no standing yeah. up. She's no. Just a, just a teeter on these little, these know, little legs like that like just barely takes stick out. balance and just puts all her weight, you know, straight up. Yeah. You got her two little legs and her little tail that comes out the back, and she just like teeters on them three. It's the funniest thing you've ever seen. And she'll and her front leg, she's like begging like this, going. I know, and her me, little me, legs, and front legs are like this long, you know. <laughs> so they're like these little velociraptor little legs. Where is that rat? She's all snuggled in her blanket over oh. there by the fire. Yeah, she'll cuddle in a blanket, and literally, I don't know how she does it. She'll you'll see her just flipping underneath there, and she'll cocoon herself in there. Then somebody'll knock on the door or. Usually not somebody knock on the door, but when the dogs will come up and scratch on the door, they want back in or something, you know. Yeah. Something will make a noise. My TV in our bedroom with the the bass and stuff will make a boom, 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 and they think something's knocking. And here she comes, right? Boom. She's stuck inside of her Oh, yeah. And blanket. She, now she's freaking worse because she's barking and, like, yeah, trying to find her running around out. trying to find out how to get out of that blanket. But it's the funniest thing. She'll take off running. And it's just like something getting caught in the net. <laughs> Snaps her back. <laughs> Poor little thing. But anyway, there's our uh, Blair Witch story. Didn't didn't have the finesse it had years ago, but yeah, we, we told you we tell the story, and there you are. It is. It's really really funny. It mm -hmm. really is. It would have been nice to have the kids' point of view tell the story while yeah. the kids were here because they're going to remember details that we don't. You know, they're going to have a different take than we have. Yeah. Anyway, I um, don't want to drag this. I'm trying not to make a 40-minute Sean Smoke moto vlog out of a storytelling thing. I know. We it's can't hard. tell. Why can't we tell anything? Just tell the story and it be over with. I don't know because you're very long-winded. It's my fault? It's it, always it's my a, fault. It's his fault. <laughs> I'll take it. Crazy old woman. Did you have a well, good Thanksgiving? I did. I did. Right. You just like to give too many details. You need mm -hmm. to hit highlights. It's all just in the details, Mama. Highlights. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Now I gotta sit down and figure out how I'm gonna shorten this video up. <laughs> <laughs> so when you see them little boop, the little waves in there, that's me taking a block of going, BS oh, okay. out of the way. Yeah, I made this a little long. I could have just said, yeah. okay, here, here. There. Yeah. And then try to stay awake while I'm vlogging it. That's hard. It's, it's kind of hard to listen to the story you just told all over again. Yeah. And not go <clears throat> at the desk, you know, banging off the keyboard. And you wake up to the computer going, dong, 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 dong. <laughs> and there's just these letters going across. Or the I look in there, you know, see what he's doing. He's like this in the chair. <laughs> he's just out cold. Yeah, she catches me out cold all the time. I have the hardest time editing my vi editing my videos. That's why the moto vlogs that I can do like a 20 minute moto vlog or less. Yeah. And go, I said everything I need to say in that thing. I just put a, you know, an intro and an outro and, and send tender. it to YouTube. She's done. <laughs> I call them my one hit wonders. And yeah. my one hit wonders are very few and far between. Yeah, it's hard. I to make one hit wonders one. sometimes. That's when I put up a 43 or even a 53 minute video. I go, you know what? That's way too, I'll never go through it all, just put it all up. Just take all the little sections of videos, stick them all together. And yeah. The beginning, an end, and a long upload to YouTube. <laughs> and then about three hours for YouTube to convert it so it'll actually play without looking all fuzzy. But anyway, see, here, look, see, you kept me going. I'm sorry. You gotta tell me just to hush it. 
know how she I never, want to wrap She can't on say on. goodbye once. She just keeps going and going and going and going. No, that's me. And I've, God help us, we've done it to our kids. All our kids here, just over and yeah. over, saying, well, we're going to go, well, we're going to go. I know. And we go all the way out to the car and still go, well, yeah, you guys. Yeah, you know, still got to hug and kiss Not, goodbye ten more times. Oh, yeah. 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 All right, one more hug, one more kiss. All right, all you guys right. take care. And then, you know, ten minutes later, we're still all standing here. Oh, okay, well, you guys take care. And then one of them gets in the car, and we have another conversation. And, yeah. But, yeah. They take after their daddy. Mm-hmm. My mom says, yeah, it always takes about ten goodbyes to get rid of the smoke family. I remember we'd go do things as a kid, you know. My mom's, like, trying to drag my dad down the front steps. You know, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. And uh, dragging him along. Getting in the car, she goes, can't you guys just say good, just say your goodbyes and walk away? Yeah. No, you gotta, and the whole family comes out all the way to the car and these. Yeah, and they're all around the car. Yeah, these yeah. new conversations start and literally you're in the car, seat belts on, and you're still having conversations through open windows. You just and look, like we're doing talk. it right now. Yeah, because y'all love to talk. We just keep, we'll keep going on. Y'all sit back. Uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna finish the night yeah, out. Here. Give it a couple minutes. So something yeah. else will spark, and he'll just keep this going. This will be a five-hour vlog about well nothing. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are gonna go. So you <laughs> we are out. God help you if you make it to the end of this thing. Oh yeah, you, you got some patience. Yeah. All right. We'll see you. Bye. Bye bye.